We're watching out for you. This is News 3 at Noon with Angela Martin and Mitch Truswell. Well, it is not always hard to find Mexican food. But finding good Mexican food is quite another story. Up next on News 3 at Noon, a local restaurant that serves up its spin on some tasty traditional dishes. Welcome back in, everyone. Two very special guests. You guys are delicious. Oh, thank you very much. Is that much. a little weird to say? Uh, no. Well, we have here in front of us, we have Matt Silverman and Troy Kumla, both with Agave and the Vintner Grill restaurants. And um, we're going to focus on Agave first, out in Summerlin. Right, we're in Summerlin. It's Charleston and 215. And uh, what we're doing, what we're displaying today is we have a brand new menu. Uh, we started the menu. It's going to start next week. And it's one of the biggest menu changes that we've done since we've opened. And uh, it's another reason why we have the best Mexican food in town. Well, let's talk about that because, you know, you can drive just about any corner. There's going to be a Mexican restaurant, but it's really hard to find good Mexican food. I've eaten right. at your place and I can vouch this well, isn't Plagola Paola. It is very good. Thank you. Um, how do you guys set yourself apart for people to come to your restaurant and not just another random restaurant in town? Well, definitely what makes us different is the quality of ingredients we use. As you see in front of us, it's top notch quality. The tequilas that we use are amazing. We have all the fresh fruit for the margaritas. Um, we get stuff in every day seasonally and we have over a hundred varieties of tequila. And, so. it, and it really, it, that is something I do notice. It's very fresh tasting. It's, it's not heavy. It doesn't, even the stuff that's fried, it doesn't give you that heavy fried feel. Yeah, there's that not, a lot not, of, not melted cheese on everything. Is that, maybe it, that's, that's what yeah, it is. Yeah, that's the, the biggest difference. Right. And uh, right now, you know, it's perfect time for the patio to sit outside and enjoy these fresh fruit margaritas. And on Saturday nights, we're doing live music now. So we have a band that plays um, live music from, I think it's 9 uh, till midnight. Oh, great. Yeah. And Troy, your food and beverage director? Correct, yes. And um, anything uh, that you'd like to add as far as a little special something something at well, your place? We, Matt and myself, we've actually traveled to Jalisco to actually get our own specialty tequila made. Oh, wow. So it is only offered at Agave. It's a single barrel. Casa Noble product that uh, nice. we're actually really proud of. We make a honey. We're hard at work. <laughs> really, we have to sample all this stuff. It's for the job. This is the first single barrel tequila in the United States, yeah. and oh, we wow. went down and hand picked it and tasted it and picked the one we wanted and bottled it. It was tough. We had to taste so. through nine barrels. Yeah. So exactly. it's, it's not going to be. It's, so it's not going to be like Jose Cuervo. Is that what you're no, trying to tell no, me? No, 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 no. We'll try it as soon as we, you know, get off the air. <laughs> Obviously, we have um, all of the stuff um, from the menu from Agave up here, but Vintner Grill, in case people don't know about it, that's also a really fast fabulous restaurant in Summerlin Thank and you. Um, you. Do you guys are you doing anything special this summer you know Vineyard Grill the menu changes daily it's very seasonal uh, so every day is different and every day is special and uh, it's right down the street from Agave on West Charleston uh, 10 100 West Charleston it's yeah and it's behind it's, it's a little bit hard to find so I always tell people make sure if you go all the way around mm -hmm. it kind of looks like it's in a regular um, building it, in, an office building. in an office building yeah but we've got tents outside cabanas with fire pits it's an amazing place to be and the food is just it's great it's great ambiance great food great everything great wine. Is. And Great you know wine. what at night it reminds Absolutely, me of? Absolutely, the wine, sorry. That people can kind of wrap their minds around. Um, the restaurant in New York with the different hanging um, lanterns. New York. In Central Park. What is the name Tavern. of that restaurant? Oh, Tavern, Tavern on the Green. Tavern 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 Thank you. Mitchell, save me. I'm tired. <laughs> okay. Um, well, you've eaten at <laughs> both have a these restaurants. Yeah. We oh, do have a giveaway. Um, before we forget and run out of time, caller number th four and five. You pick. Let's do caller number four and five, six five seven three four two five, and two fifty dollar. You guys are very generous. Two fifty dollar gift certificates. Callers number four and five. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, and you didn't you win a prize for the margaritas? Yeah, that's what best I remember. margarita in town, yeah. voted by uh, Las Vegas Life, I believe. Yes. Yeah, oh. that's what came to mind. Voted by Mitch Trustwell. <laughs> yeah, it looks good. Okay, <laughs> folks, when we come back, uh, we Jonathan.